13 year long program to build bioweapons labs in populated cities all over the United States that get around the weapons treaties by saying they're testing how to treat these weapons, but they're making these weapons. So what's going to happen if this stuff gets out? Will that be the crisis to bring in global governance and martial law? Is that why they're preparing? We should look at the West, who's done all this secret experimentation and weaponizing of viruses and bacteria on record as prime suspects involved in the worst Ebola outbreak ever. And doctors and scientists and epidemiologists and virologists are saying that it looks like Ebola is getting stronger. It's mutating. And then we've got all these top globalists that go and hang out with Prince Charles, dancing around making statements about soon the airborne Ebola will be out and 90% of you will die. And I'm sad, but it's best for the earth. And, and it's, it's, it's for the new world order and for Lucifer. These are quotes, by the way, of major department heads. Scary enough that the FBI went and visited them when I threw a fit. So that says something for the FBI. I guess they love their kids. I guess you better look into biology department heads who talk like that. Because let me tell you something, folks. They're gearing up for the organized collapse of civilization. Will it be World War III? Will it be global financial collapse? Will it be the purposeful shutting off of the power systems worldwide? It's all happening. The globalists are waging war against civilization, except for compartmentalized, breakaway civilization grids that they control. That's a military tactic. Shut down your enemy's technology, only you have it. No one will enter the New World Order unless he or she will make a pledge to worship Lucifer. No one will enter the New Age unless he will take a Luciferian initiation. David Spangler, American spiritual philosopher, author, considered one of the founding figures of the modern New Age movement. And he said that in a publication of the Council on Foreign Relations in Congressional Testimony. And by the way, I've been around these people. I'm not even going to tell people something. I'm not going to say it. I mean, it's, just, it's too much. People can't even handle it. I saw that clip of that Mason one time that a Christian confronted about worshiping Lucifer. And he goes, oh, sweet Lucifer. Oh, sweet Lucifer. But I'll tell you at the top, they're, they're Luciferians, folks. And they're not devil worshipers. There's a big difference. And uh, they think that they want to save the earth by wiping everybody out. And you can look at what humans have become and the things we do, and you could have that argument. But I want to take your phone calls. Let's go to your phone calls right now. Let's talk to Kevin in Mississippi. You're on the air. Welcome. Hello. Yes, sir. You want to talk, bro? Hell yeah. You want to talk, brother? Yeah, I want to talk. How you doing, Alex? Good. Go ahead. Uh, I was wondering, is the government going to do anything about stopping anybody from coming from Africa over to our country with that Ebola disease? Or are they just going to let everybody jump on planes and come on over here so that they can kill us all? Well, that would be racist if we stopped someone with Ebola from coming over. Uh, well, I mean, the main track to get in illegally, if you can't get a visa, is you go to Mexico, you land... And as long as you don't get off the bus, they don't stop you. And, and no, it's being predicted by virologists that if this outbreak of Ebola continues, uh, it will come across the border. But again, Geraldo Rivera said that anything south of the border can't be criticized. If, if you were in Guatemala City and didn't like your beans and rice and fish, that would be racist. You just accept anything that, that uh, you know, I mean, if an alien spaceship landed in Mexico and flesh-eating goblins came off that were going to eat us, we would have to accept it because it originated in Mexico, sir. Um, that was something I was wanting to ask you. Uh, have y'all heard anything about the Chinese that are supposed to have uh, bought the National DeSoto Forest over here in Mississippi? I know that, yes, Chinese firms are buying up giant swaths of public and private land all over the United States. They're basically state-run fronts. Uh, and then they pay off the locals and don't follow any of the laws and operate as a mafia. And they're 
arresting and taking the organs of Christians in China. That was in the news yesterday and blowing up churches and taking down crosses on churches. But any, any criticism of that is anti-Asian. I thought I was criticizing authoritarianism. But again, if you criticize Hitler, it means you're anti-German. This is the new political correctness. So you just need to accept that, sir. Well, uh, I don't, I don't uh, criticize Hitler because I have a full understanding of why Hitler done what he done way back when. But uh, that was then, and this is now, and what we got now is a real big bad problem with that border down there. And what I want to know is why ain't the Texans, New Mexicos, Arizonians, New and Californians going down there to put a stop to all that coming? Well, you can go do it, sir. Uh, listen, I've read Mein Comp. Have you read my struggle, sir? Have you read my struggle? I, I, just, I was introduced to you by my son about seven months ago. Well, I'm glad you're tuning in, brother, but, but let me just explain something. What we've been told about Hitler in most history books is not accurate, but the real Hitler was a complete lunatic as well and was set up by British intelligence. Your prayers and support. By the way, the specials end uh, in just a couple days. You can get 5.3 months free at prisonplanet.tv. Again, you can always get two months free when you sign up for a year off the monthly price. If you go month to month, it's $5.95. The price goes down by an equivalent of two months free when you sign up anytime for a year. But when we do the special, we take another three plus months of the price off. So it comes out to five plus months free when you sign up for a year. So you pay for a little more than six months, you get more than five months free, prisonplanet.tv. See all my films, the nightly news, so much more, commercial free video and audio podcasts, special reports on the road, 18, 19 years of material, prisonplanet.tv. I want to thank all the members you helped finance so much of what we're doing with the cutting edge of true independent, pro-liberty, pro-human, pro-empowerment media, truth media. We wear our bias to tell the truth and to stand up for freedom on our sleeve. We tell you openly what we stand for. Prisonplanet.tv through the month of July. One membership, by the way, is 11 memberships. 11 people can use the Prisonplanet.tv membership. Infowarsnews.com, same URL. And until tomorrow, we're running a special. Huge discounts on all the Made in America apparel. The Molon Labe belt buckles, the Molon Labe shirts, uh, you name it, the made in 1776 ball caps uh, and the uh, golf shirts and water bottles that help spread the word and meet like-minded people. The Navy SEAL made bottle breachers, 50 cal, uh, rifle bullet, all of it, InfoWarsLife.com, MadeIn1776.com, InfoWarsStore.com is the master URL. InfoWarsStore.com or call toll-free. 888-253-3139. But those specials will end on the 1st. So please take advantage of it and support the InfoWar while you are at it. And again, we couldn't have done any of this without you. Uh, let's talk to Jay in Texas. What do you think the next big crisis is going to be? This is the season of manufactured crises. What do you think? Alex, you know... Um, I got to say, you know, this, we did have a warning back in 2001 when, uh, we had the, the towers taken down, but of course in an inside job, but I think that we're heading, we're heading that way in, in, in some way, some sort, you know, the war and in the Middle East, and then we have war in Russia and Ukraine, you know, it leaves us out. I mean, the U S is never out of a war regardless, you know, what stand is. So I think we're going to have to blackmail something, someone's going to get blackmailed, something's going to happen and we're going to get involved and I'm afraid it's going to be a inside job here in, in, in our United States, you know, in, in our country. Well, I agree with you because you notice that Obama keeps saying, I'm worried about just someone nuking Manhattan. I'm not going to say who, but then you look at the movies and what they're pre-programming, it's patriots linking up with radical Muslims to then blame us for it. Like U.S. Army, who was anti-Obama, detonated the nuke in New York City or in D.C. And really, it'll be the globalists to bring in their hard coup. And I'm telling you, all the Homeland Security preparations, folks, are for a takeover. Our ace in the hole is the average Homeland Security person is actually 
awake. <laughs> I've been amazed. So the globalists have a real problem on their hands. We'll be back. Stay with us. Thank you for FBI, listening FBI, Secret Service, a lot of them are awake. Visit GCN. Uh, most military's is awake. Most local police are starting to wake up. This is Alex Jones for InfoWarsLife.com. The latest in preparedness is now here. An electrically stabilized colloidal silver solution that can be added to both your home cabinet and preparedness pack alike. Concentrated to 30 parts per million in what has been dubbed the Survival Silver Solution. The new InfoWars Life Silver Bullet Colloidal Silver is the answer for you and your family. And it's entirely free of toxic artificial additives that are loaded into many products. The InfoWars Life Silver Bullet Silver is so powerful that it is concentrated into a two ounce bottle and is not recommended for extended continual use. This is not a low grade formula. We are working with one of the top laboratory manufacturers in the United States to bring you the best form of colloidal silver using electrical processes within a base of deionized water for your preparedness storage or your home kitchen. Purchase your bottle of InfoWarsLife.com Silver Bullet Colloidal Silver today and find other amazing supplements at InfoWarsLife.com.